given a square plus b square plus ab equals v. Let's denote that as condition one. To figure out the maximum value of a square plus b square minus ab. Let's express it in terms of the given condition. So we get a square plus b square plus ab. So we need to minus 2ab, right? We know this part equals 3. So we get 3 minus 2 times a times b. We denote that as condition star. Because here is minus, so the maximum on the left side is equal to finding the minimum of ab, right? So write down, so the maximum of the left side a squared plus b squared minus a b is equivalent to finding the minimum of a b. Okay, so to find the minimum of a b, let's use the condition again. So both sides at a b, so we get one. So at a b, so we get a square plus b square plus 2 times a b, the right side, 3 plus a b. You know the left side is a perfect square, so a plus b square, the right side, 3 plus a b. So we can write a b as both sides of just 3. So okay. a a yeah, a plus b squared minus v. We know there's a non-negative. So, of course, this one's greater than or equal to negative 3. When we get the minimum of a, b, when a plus b equals 0, right? So, I say minimum negative 3 of a, b can be obtained when this part equals zero. So when a plus b equals zero, or you can say a equals negative b. Actually, you can plug into the given condition. So we get a squared, so it would be negative b squared plus b squared plus a, which is negative b times b equals three. Right? So actually, it's simplify the left side, which is b squared equals 3. Taking square root, so we get b equals plus or minus square root of 3. Anyway, so by the condition star, we get the maximum value of a squared plus b squared minus ab would be equal to 3 minus 2 times the minimum of ab which is negative 3. So 3 plus 6 equals 9. That is the final answer. If you like this video, please subscribe. Thank you.